made you breakfast Fresh coffee and bagels too A new day is waiting for us We got lots of fun stuff to do Let's go to the zoo and feed the monkeys I can lend them your baseball cap Let's make the day a bear and our fun Growing up is just a trap Just a bit fat trail. Sausage and cantaloupe. Oh, you want me to hold this? Good morning, everybody. We finished breakfast. I got the kitchen cleaned up. The kids have started the schoolwork. I'm making my coffee now and I'm trying the Aldi Donut Store coffee. They call theirs Donut Store instead of Donut Shop. And I'm trying this caramel macchiato creamer that I got from there. It's a little bit chilly again this morning, so I'm gonna go with hot coffee. Okay, let's see how it is. It's very good. It actually tastes just like Walmart's Donut Shop coffee. And the creamer, it doesn't taste extremely caramel-like. It's not like super, super sweet. It's really good. I would definitely get this and the coffee again. All right, we're gonna get this day going. I think Manly is almost ready for his nap, so we'll see how long he lasts before nap time. Jonah is on unit 33 in his spelling book. That means there are only three more units. Do you know what that means? No. I think he'll finish this book before school is done. Look at that. Look at that. <laughs> oh my, arts and crafts already this morning. That's lovely. Is that a, you got a little goatee? Uh -huh. Oh, I like it. Manny, are you doing schoolwork? Yeah. Are you doing schoolwork? No. Lunch break. Trying to figure out what we're gonna have for lunch today. Does anybody want hot dogs? <laughs> the kids got tired of hot dogs. Y'all remember there for a while they were wanting to do hot dogs every night almost. They were wanting to roast hot dogs. Now they're tired of them. You want noodles? Whoa. All right, John and Audra want noodles and I'm giving them some crackers and some of these little pepper jack cheese wedges. And I got these little caramel dip pouches from Ingles the other day. I'm gonna divide one of these for them to dip their apples in. Jacob and Tyler want the leftovers from supper last night. We had some chicken and corn and some beans left over, so that's what they want. All right, here's their lunch for today. Noodles, broccoli, apples with caramel, oat and ranch for the broccoli. Sissy, I gave her cheese cubes because she doesn't like the little smooth cheese wedges and crackers. And here's Jonah, same thing, but the different cheese. <laughs> Come on, you gotta eat lunch first, then you go outside. Yeah? Yeah, you're gonna go outside after you eat lunch, okay? Here's Manly's lunch. This makes him happy. Here, you want me to turn it around this way? That way you can get to the yogurt better. He feels like he's one of the big kids when he has one of these plates. He's gonna dip everything in the yogurt. He just has some strawberry yogurt, cucumber. He loves cucumber. I just cut them up into little pieces. Some strawberries, ham, cheese, and crackers. Yeah? Yeah. He dips the cucumbers and everything in yogurt, so. Uh-oh. Uh oh, uh oh, it's okay. He usually tells me no to everything, but I just let him sit here with it for a little bit and he'll eventually start eating it. Oh, you got a strawberry. 
There's your Ellie spoon for your yogurt. Go ahead. Yummy, yummy. No. Mmm. That's good. It's good. Yeah, it's good. There's your water. Jonah wanted one of the little mango smoothies. Sissy doesn't really like those, but she loves the sparkling waters like mama, huh? So she's having a lime sparkling water with her lunch. I'm having the Jessica O'Donohue special. <laughs> Cheese, black forest ham, and pickle chips. We're gonna come outside for a little bit. Jonah and Audra are looking for tadpoles. They got something they wanna show us. A crawdad? And a tadpole. Oh, there's the crawdad. Does he pinch you? Yeah, he did it once. Does it hurt? Mm -mm. I wanted to tell y'all about the swing real quick because I had a couple of questions about it. It does come with these two pillows and it has this little pocket. Uh oh, I think somebody insided it out. Hang on. It goes this way, not that way. But anyway, there's a pocket on the side right here that you can put whatever you want to put in there. And like right now, it's looking pretty good. I guess you just have to fix it. Yeah, I guess you just have to fix the pillows just right every time. And the kids don't. When they get out, they just let the pillows fall. And so then it just looks like... Titus said it looked like Casper hanging out here. Anyway, if you fix the pillows right, it looks like a seat. And it looks fine. Anyway, yeah, that's the update on it. I wanted to tell y'all because a couple of people asked if I liked it. And I really do. It's just that if you don't fix those pillows right, it looks kind of sloppy. For anybody who didn't see the grocery haul, this came from Aldi, by the way. It was $24.99. Uh-oh, I hear them. They're happy we're coming. Uh-oh, you got sticky, you got dirty. Anytime his hands are dirty, he says sticky. <laughs> Here we go, look, they hear us coming. You hear them? You calling Cece? Where'd she go? Quack, quack. They see you coming, they're getting happy. Only three this afternoon. Tell them bye. Yeah, that's the rooster. Okay, y'all, it is time to cook supper now. Tonight, we're doing a quick one. I'm making the baked spaghetti, or baked rotini, because I'm using rotini pasta. These. So, I'm doing it just like baked spaghetti though, just using these instead of spaghetti noodles. And we're gonna make that garlic cheese bread that I got from Aldi to go with it. I'm really excited about it because a lot of y'all said it was good. This is one of those super easy deals right here. We're just using the jarred pasta sauce. And I'm gonna make a salad. I think, I'm just gonna put this ground beef back in the refrigerator. This is over five pounds here. I'm gonna be using about two pounds for this pasta. The rest of it, I'm just gonna wrap up really tight and put it back in the refrigerator because I need to make the slider patties because I'm gonna be using the rest of it for sliders. And I'll probably just go ahead and make those tomorrow because if I don't use it by tomorrow, I would need to stick it in the freezer. I've had some more people ask about cleaning the iron skillet. I showed in a video how I do it. I can't remember which video it was. I'll try to find it and link it down below. But if I can't find my video, I'll link Kent Rollins' video down below for y'all where he talks all about the cast iron things all the things mama. Mini. he loves mama i'm making mama. spaghetti oh, there's a nana you always look for nanas when you come up here huh you want a nana mama. okay we went to get eggs didn't we hey can you sing this song for everybody y'all know his little monkey that he has mama. well it sings the apples and banana mama. song and he sings it with the monkey mama. i'm gonna see if i can get him to sing mama. it yeah i like to eat 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 apples and bananas i like to eat 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 apples and bananas <laughs> it is so cute he sings it with the monkey it's adorable he dances when he says it does it with the monkey i'm gonna go ahead and turn the oven on and put the cheese bread in that way it'll be almost done when it's time to put the pasta bake in manly's gonna help me get the bread that's the wrong way we gotta go this way can you carry that one? Yeah? Okay. Mama's got this one, Manny's got that one. We're gonna take it to the kitchen. <laughs> he thinks it should go on the bench. Come on, let's go. Here we go. Are you copying me? It says the oven needs to be at 420, but I'm gonna go to 400, cause like I've told y'all before, my oven tends to burn things if we don't pay very close attention. <laughs>
now we mix it together and y'all I'm gonna go ahead and tell you I already tasted that cheese bread oh my goodness it is so good y'all were correct very correct on that one it is delicious spray the casserole dish and we pour it in but it's kind of heavy right now so I'm not gonna chance that I'm gonna put it in with the spoon at first when it gets a little lighter we'll dump the rest of it in Okay, I was looking for the Parmesan cheese. I thought I just bought some, but I must not have, or either I just don't know where I put it. So, we'll just skip that. I was gonna sprinkle a little Parmesan on top. We'll go straight to the mozzarella. I'm leaving this spot over here without any cheese. Sometimes Tyler doesn't like the melted cheese on top. We'll leave this section without. We're just gonna put it in the oven until the cheese melts and starts to brown a little bit on top. I have a little bit of pasta left that couldn't fit in there, so I'm gonna put this in a bowl and I'll make some pasta salad with it tomorrow. You want one? Mmm. Yeah. Shoo. You don't like it? He likes Shoo. the bread. Shoo. Shoo. He likes the bread though. Is that good? Mmm. <laughs> It's cleanup time, and I have both of my little boy. I'm sorry, Jonah told me the other day he's not a little boy anymore. He's part of the big boys. I have one big boy here and one little boy here. Sissy's up feeding with Daddy and the other boys, so we are on cleanup duty. Do you want to do dishes or clearing the table and sweeping the floor? Let's rock, paper, scissor it, boy. Are we doing two out of three or just one? Wait, which one do you want? Dishes. All right, so whoever wins does the dishes. Ready? Manly's joining in, too. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Ah! <laughs>